everybody and welcome back to the lab so this is rags to riches part 13 or 14 i think it's it's part 13 so i told you guys the next time you guys would see me it'll be leilani telling london we're pregnant um and she'll be like how are you pregnant if you told me the insemination failed and she told her you know I was really mad at you that you weren't taking it serious. I met up with my friends, talked about it, and she just told London, like, I'm pregnant. And London was like, how are you pregnant if the insemination failed? Like, that doesn't make any sense. And then she said, I got in. So remember how I was publicly disgraced? My name was in the headlines for me being, uh, what was it for? Her being drunk or... Yeah, her being drunk in her apartment in London is just like, yeah, I remember that. She's like, yeah, like Sincere. Sincere was here, and we were talking about his medical history. I was telling him about me, my fertility issues, and we'd gotten drunk, and we hooked up twice, and I'm pregnant, and London is disgusted with her. I think we're gonna get a notification whether to forgive her or not. So I'm gonna ask Siri to pick between one and two. One obviously being that we accept it and move on. And then two being we can't accept it, break up. So that's what just happened. So I'm going to play it. Oh my God. I think this is where they're going to wait before they ask each other or before that message pops up. It says a fault confessed from admitting to cheating is a fault. Is a fault confessed have forgiven. Leilani doesn't feel that way right now after confessing to her partner having wooed with someone else. And we're going to go to London and London is angry. It says unfaithful love from learning about cheating. London's significant other has cheated on her and she thought the relationship was heading somewhere and damaged trust from being told about cheating. Ah, to believe that your most loved one is truthful in their affections only to hear them say they gave them to another. Be it for the who only or be it more than that, cheating is cheating. And London's partner just confessed to having woohooed with another. What should London do? So obviously the first option is give the relationship and her partner a chance. And then the second one, it's too painful and hopeless. Just break up with them. So I'm gonna ask Siri, pick between one and two. And whatever Siri picks, that's what we're going with. So, hey Siri. Hmm? Pick between one and two. One plus two is three. No. <laughs> hey Siri, pick a number between one and two. It's one. Okay, so Siri picked one. You know what? We're gonna do a best out of three. Pick a number between one and two. It's two. Okay, so now we got two. So now this is the tiebreaker. She either forgives her and they move on with their relationship or two. Obviously, if they move on with their relationship, they have to repair that trust. Leilani will have to cut off all ties with Sincere, but now it's different because they didn't do it through the insemination. They had sex, so Sincere can have rights to see the child. So, hey Siri, pick a number, but pick a number between one and two. Okay, I found this on the web for pick. No, hey Siri, pick a pick a number between one and two. A random number between one and two is two. Oh, so. They're breaking up. Siri picked two and they're breaking up or they broke up. So now they have a new sentiment. Um, 
says furious about cheating. London cannot believe Leilani would do this to their relationship. Just the sight of Leilani remi will remind London that Leilani betrayed her trust and cheated on her. So are y'all going to break up or... Or you know what, before we do that, let's ask her, like, London is too angry to do this. Let's ask her, like, what was, let's ask her her reasons for having cheated. And Leilani is just smiling. Okay, London is flirty now? Like, I'm so confused. She's still in love with her. London will mourn and cry over what was love and what was lost. London will be wrecked with self-doubt and fear of arrival, taking over a future partner's lover again. But London will not stick around to see the face of the same who betrayed her. She is leaving that cheater. But it says y'all are still girlfriends. So maybe I have to do the interaction again. But let's ask her one more time. Ask her the reason for why she cheated. So we'll say... Um, Leilani, because it was true, she was in intoxicated and it simply haven't happened. Um, <laughs> we'll say that. Leilani, she was drunk and don't blow a kiss at her. You're mad at her. What? She cheated. Okay, so that moodlet says, so it says lame excuse from hearing cheating reasons. reasons. London's partner justified their cheating with having had too much of a good thing or another what sort of excuse is that i was drunk or worse well maybe don't get so wasted in the first place when there's people around who are going to make advances on you or you and on them london sure still thinks what happened is her partner's fault which it com it completely is so let's see what leilani is not sure where the fatal mistake lay cheating or admitted to having cheated either way Ooh. Either way, her partner could not tolerate the news of Leilani's infidelity and broke them up. Perhaps there will be a chance to reconquer their love, but it won't happen today. And I can't blame her. Then she's having a mood swing right now. The slightest little things are making Leilani want to cry. Her hormones are all out of whack. I So I thought they were going to break up. I told London to break up with her. So now, yeah. So we're going to ask her about her suspicious closeness with uh, Sincere. And now they know each other. Darling, you're worrying over nothing. We're just friends. That's a lie because you already said that you had, you had sex with him and now you're pregnant. But, um... I'm just confused like maybe it's a glitch going on we're going to refuse to forgive for cheating because that was the option the second option that was that and she's like you know it's crazy because you told me you were cheated on and now you cheated on me they're just still like they're not upset enough for me like She's happy, and then Leilani is just inspired still. So I guess we can threaten to break up. I never use these interactions. Oh, God, now she's angry all over again. Oh, she's going to be angry for four days. Then now Leilani is sad. But it's mainly from her pregnancy. It's not even her being threatened to break up. True consequences. Well, Leilani's partner took her romantic interactions with another very badly. In a fit of anger, they declared they could not forgive her. If Leilani wants to patch things up, it'll just have to take some time. Um, now they're upset. And their, relation, their relationship went down so much. So is there anything that we can do on Leilani's end that'll like help the situation? So guys, we're gonna ask, so we're gonna like play her really quick. So we're gonna ask Leilani to sever ties. Well, obviously, you know what? We can't even do that because that's her child's father. 
so we're actually going to um let's ask about her suspicious closeness with him again i want to see if anything will change because she had already confessed that and now they have yeah more sentiments so london is furious with leilani she's furious about the cheating she's hurt and she's sad and and yeah i don't know why they don't just break up though we're bringing over nothing we're just being friends can we ask her to take a dna test just to like make sure so they're both going to do the dna test because london wants to make sure that you know what leilani said was true and she didn't like cheat with anybody else but leilani is very sad and now it's gonna be like really the sim is not the father but we, but we knew that we knew that you can't be the father anyway so we have a major turn of event so they were gonna break up they didn't break up yet they did the paternity test london you know got upset but london is confessing to cheating on leilani too which i don't know how that's possible because i'm controlling london and she doesn't have she doesn't have a relation another romantic bar why does she have one with Okay, it says N.A. We don't know who she messed with, but the only people that she knows is Alex, Taylor, Beckett, Victoria, and now she knows Sincere. But we confessed to Leilani too that we cheated as well. Or maybe she's just lying and she's just saying it just to like make Leilani hurt. So now, accuse Leilani of being a racist girl, no. And then she wants to ask her for sex? Girl, no. Why are you so... Y'all both did stuff to each other and this... Oh, accused of cheating. She... We know. We know. We know what she did. Why can't they break up? Oh, so London just asked her again, like, why did you cheat on me? And Leilani said, I don't love you and I'm not sorry if that hurts. This relationship was always a joke. Now I just think London is mad and, or not London, now I just think Leilani is mad and she said the relationship was a joke. So I got this notification. At first I canceled it and then they did it again. So it says there really is a thin line between love and hate and I did not think they were going to do this. But they definitely did, and I don't know if they got a moodlet from that. So it says, what the, from hate woohoo, why am I having woohoo with someone I hate? I guess there really is a thin line between love and hate. And, oh, she got a intuition never lies i just know they're cheating on me we don't woohoo like we used to and i've seen the way they look at other sims um so leilani so london's new sentiments opposites attract london has romantic feelings for leilani even though they are very different sims and then london feels guilty leilani feels bad about something that happened but with, what that happened with london but doesn't know how to make it right and then she has a festering gr grudge and they just have a lot going on so i'm going to end the episode here i don't know what's going to happen i don't know what's going to happen between london and leilani i told london to break up with her she didn't i've tried getting them upset i've tried insulting both on both ends making them insult each other and the breakup option is not there I don't know if this is the start to a toxic relationship, but Leilani is pregnant. I don't want her to have to like go through all of this stress. So I'm thinking since they didn't break up, they both need to give each other a break. Leilani needs to just focus on having a happy, healthy baby and how to have that conversation with Sincere, which we're going to have in the next part.
what their schedule is going to look like. Leilani isn't getting rid of the baby. Even though she cheated on London, Leilani is happy to be pregnant. It happened the wrong way because it's supposed to be with London. But I will see you guys in the next episode. Thank you for watching.